which means St. Patrick's Day crafts. Today I am going to make a luck poster that is made out of pennies because heads up pennies mean good luck and leprechauns bring luck and shamrocks bring luck. Somehow it's gonna all go together. But that is what we're doing today. So the first step is going to be, I bought these luck sign. They're just like, I guess they're wood, little things that spell luck. And I've got some gold spray paint from Home Depot. I'm going to spray paint them today. I am not using my normal cardboard backdrop. I'm just using the grass because the landscaper is coming tomorrow and he's gonna cut the grass anyways and I'm being lazy and don't wanna pull it out. This was totally unexpected, but these gold clovers are badass. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is take that yellow tape. I'm going to tape off the canvas and then paint it green. All right, so I wasn't really um, particular about how I laid the stripes down. It didn't really make a difference. I then alternated between a dark green and a light green, and they did need actually a ton of coats of paint to cover up the white canvas. Also, another tip is I didn't really plan it out. I thought we had painter's tape, which is blue. I couldn't find it, so I used an automotive tape, and it kind of bled. Okay, so while the canvas is drying, I am going to start to hot glue the pennies onto the luck sign that we spray painted gold earlier. All right, to glue the pennies on, I kind of staggered them a little bit so that they hung off the side and they also kind of covered in the gaps. It took quite a few pennies. They dried super quick though. All right, so now all of the pennies are glued onto the wood letter. Can't really see the gold, which is why it didn't matter that I painted it in the grass. It kind of was just to cover up the side. All right, so now I'm going to take the yellow tape off the canvas and hot glue those little letters onto the canvas. All right, like I mentioned earlier, I did use an automotive tape, so the paint did bleed through a little bit on the canvas. All right, it's definitely something that can be touched up with white paint. And then to glue the luck on, I just put a ton of hot glue on the back of the letter and then put it directly onto the canvas. There you have it, an easy St. Paddy's Day craft.